Yeah. What's up? What's good? Let us move on. It's been a while, but you know what? That's alright. That's the combo I want to do it. I have to do it. Yeah, that's a good combo. So I'm gonna do this. Let's see. Uh, I guess we'll have there's nothing going on on the screen. Nothing of interest and then we're just moving forward. Let's see if I can talk about something. Let's talk about the game first. Our main character. This guy, Soma Cruz, age, who knows? Apparently a high school student. He and his friend ended up here, tracking his castle, which is trapped inside of a solar eclipse. Trapped, so you'll take your choice of words. Um, yeah, that's pretty weird, but alright. <sighs> oh, yeah, and the years. 2035. You know what that means? Because, I don't know. It's just sometime. It's not quite here, it's not quite here. So who knows? This might actually happen one day. Nah, no, I'm joking. I don't, I don't even think so. <laughs> That'd be pretty crazy. Yeah, so anyway, this summer guy, this guy here, he came to this castle and discovered he has the power to absorb the souls of monsters and demons. Yeah, all these monsters. But I've only absorbed a handful of souls, so... Which is alright, we're not gonna get... We probably won't get every soul, a soul from every enemy you beat the first time you get this but... Yeah. Expect... Lots... And... Lots of... Them. Here's called the Scarf. Yeah, you know that. It gives what? Two defense? Yeah, two defense. But the pendant I have equipped gives one luck. My goodness. And the luck in this game is a stat that affects the drop rate of things. Souls and movement. Souls and enemy items are affected by your luck. So a higher luck stat means. Stats. Strength. Strength. Kind of. Just auto explain, but. That affects how much damage your weapon does. And when I say it affects how much damage, I mean every point of strength gives you one. gives. it adds one damage to your attack. So if you unequip some of everything, your attack and your strength will be the same number. Someone's defense is based on his constitution. Constitution is the stat, not defense. And for every two points of constitution, that's one point of defense. Amazing. And intelligence affects the damage that your soul attacks you. And also affects the way in which you go with and be on your face. This handy little soldier is called Zombie Soldier. What's it good for? Well, let's see what Zombie Soldier does. Yeah, he throws hand grenades. Is that useful? Yeah, it is. That is useless. Of course, I don't like to use it too much myself. I like to keep it in. Uh, I like to keep it for one particular boss fight. Actually, it's good to cut the boss fights. Because the first few boss fights aren't really bosses. Oh yeah, I said it. They're not really bosses. They're just normal enemies. Who 
rarer normal enemies, and which is true, but they're still normal enemies. And you know, they're kind of tough to actually run into early in the game, you know, like now. So it's a good idea to put them as bosses, actually. But I don't think you can get anything from them. Not this one. Uh, and this crow's getting turned off. I'm kind of embarrassed that I've never had one before. Um, anything else I can really do right now? Skull Archer, nice. Thanks for that oh so handy thing. Skull Archer, this soul is really strong early in the game. And it's really easy to use too. Just, it might be hard to hit stuff. And you see, it works really simple. You use it, a bow appears, and you know, Then that bow fires one arrow in a straight line, doing pretty good damage to that bow. Extra souls don't do anything. Well, that's a lie. They do something. Uh, that's something we'll be explaining later when uh, time best calls for it. Bat. This soul is. It has limited usage, because it has limited range, but it works well for killing killer fish and bats. Because those enemies have to get close to you to do damage, they don't have much life, and the bat soul is actually fairly powerful. Yeah, like I said, the bat soul is fairly powerful. So, we're gonna close in on this part very soon. So, yeah. I'm gonna say, how's my bat doing this? No, 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 no. I don't actually mind stopping to watch this game. There's so much to talk about, isn't there? <laughs> Alright, so. Oh, like 20 seconds. Oh, see in the next part, go to the chapel, because every Castlevania game has a chapel sequence, right? <laughs> right.